we ended up getting the the new car from my wife today and it's a it's a pretty cool car um it was raining all day so i didn't get a nice picture of it but i will get one i'll show you one but yes it's a it's a very interesting car uh it's an hybrid it's a prius toyota prius and it's uh it's it's running very well it's working well it uh it doesn't make much sound and it's uh very very you save a lot of money just with the the gas mileage and oh my god it was pretty cheap for the distance we we drove today and at the same time my uh my car was in the shop to uh get fixed so i ended up uh paying a bit to in order to make it work properly the the exhaust system was not working properly so it was uh i was getting fumes in the car and uh, exhaust it was exhausting directly in the car and so yeah, it, it was giving giving us headaches so that's that's not good it's easy to just go and see that the new car is better and we just dismiss the old one and just yeah doesn't we don't care about this one and at some point we we were wondering if we should get rid of it uh depending on how much it would cost to uh fix to fix it and it it ended up be, being quite reasonable for uh, for the amount of money that i had to spend for uh, fixing it so it was not that bad but it made me think that even though my wife ha has a new car and it's very nice very very fun to drive it's not a reason to get myself a new car too because i don't really need a new car i don't drive that much first and uh i don't i don't drive as much as her so i can't find a reason why i would buy a new car unless the car i've got is not working anymore and still i still have the minivan so it's not that big of a deal so i i, f I found it interesting to see the the correlation between that and also being um, happy with what you got and not uh, be envious of others because you know it's easy to just say huh hey, well she's got a new car i want a new car too but how am i gonna pay for it for for that so <laughs> that's one big uh, big reason why i shouldn't get a new car but it's so easy to be envious of others when we don't see what we've got sure my, my car is older it's uh, 2003 and uh, hers is uh, 2013 so sure there's that but mine is still in good shape and it's it just needed a few fixes here and there so at the end of the day it didn't mean that i should get a new one it, it was not um it was not mandatory that I get a new one because it's still running it's it's still working fine so overall be grateful of what you've got don't be envious of others and be sure to to take care of what you've got yes take care of it because even though this is an old car it's not a reason to beat it up it's not a reason to just dismiss this as meh it's old I don't care about it but i do care i do care about what i have i care about keeping what i have for the longest time as po as long as possible because i can't just justify buying new stuff just because i i'm getting tired of it for one reason or because i didn't take care of it what's it, what tells me that i'm gonna take it take care of a new car more than the one i've got now so if you show respect and um, an attention to details for the smaller things you'll be able to handle bigger ones so that's it for me today till tomorrow ciao